So, there's a bunch of people watching me, and lighting is super bad. Hey, little guy. Anyways, uh, this morning I was getting everything ready for my store to open, and I realized I had no printer paper, I mean printer ink. And that's kind of important to print receipts and all that stuff, so we had to make an emergency trip all the way to our nearby city, which is an hour away, and we drove so crazy to get here. But by the time we got here, it was 11, and that is the time that I chose to make my store live. So while we were sitting in the Walmart parking lot, I made the store live. And then one of my friends actually told me that the site wasn't letting her check out. So I had sat in the parking lot for an extra 20 minutes trying to figure all that out. I was so unbelievably stressed to find out that the site wasn't letting anybody check out. But luckily we figured all that out and uh, yeah, my site is finally live. So when I get home, I will be filling orders. So far I only have one, but that's because I had difficulties and like everybody was trying to check out at the same time, but it wasn't letting them. So I did update like Instagram and Facebook and told everybody that the problem has been solved and if anybody runs into any further problems to please let me know. But so far, it's been okay. But yeah, I am so unbelievably happy right now. Like, oh my god. My, it wasn't, like, real to me until it hasn't hit me that it's real. Like, that I own my own store. And that, like, everything until that first order came in. And now I'm like freaking out because I'm like, oh my God, I own an online clothing store. I can't believe that. You know how crazy that is? I literally, I never thought a year ago from, whoa, a year ago from now, I would own my own online store. Not even a fucking clue. A year ago from now, I thought I would own my own nail salon, honestly. But now that I own my own online store, this is so crazy. Just like, I am so grateful to bring you guys on this ride and yeah, it's just insane. And, yeah. <laughs> he went and got a Starbucks while I was eating my spaghetti. Still really zoomed in, Jesus. Oh. Your drink, my dear. Thank you, baby. And mine is burning my thumb. So I got the a venti, uh, a venti Ice vanilla <laughs> vanilla latte with two pumps caramel. Yes, that is my go-to coffee when I go to Starbucks. Anyways, this is a four minute clip, so I'm gonna end it now. There. Okay. So, I look really rough. I did not sleep very well last night. Um, I was really, really excited for my store to launch yesterday, and after we got all the problems figured out, it was like 12.30, and I was supposed to launch at 1, I mean 11. But the store was live, just nobody could check out. But we got that issue resolved, and I actually only ended up making one order yesterday. I mean, I'm still very grateful, but kind of bummed me out. Because I can see how many people visited my site, and then added things to their cart, and then left their cart abandoned. And that kind of, it stings a little bit. It's like seeing how many views you get on a YouTube video, but you compare it to how many likes you got on that video, and yeah, it just, it stings a little, and I know you're not supposed to, like, focus on numbers, but with a business, you kind of have to. So, after only getting one sale, 
yesterday kind of stung pretty bad. Hi, buddy. So, what? Anyways, I have class today. Um, actually, I didn't even tell you guys, but I finished English 12, which was my last curriculum for grade 12. All I have are my extra curriculums, uh, which are food and art. On Tuesday, I'm actually doing my last art project for art 12, so I'll be done that. And then um, t today, I am actually cooking two meals for foods 12. And that means I'll only have four things left to cook and I could get them all done within this week, which is really exciting. And then I'll be done high school. Uh, you know how dreaded I've had this? Like, oh my god. Then I also mentioned to you guys that I thought about going into real estate. And I've had some time to like really think about it and like really decide if that's what I want to do. And honestly... I don't know it like it really interests me but I am I don't know if I want to do it in the long run after thinking about it for a while just like nails I just jumped on the opportunity to go to school for it and I ended up not wanting to do that I finished I got the degree or the license but I don't want to do it now and I don't want to spend $4,000 again to go back to school for something completely different and not end up wanting to do that, but be stuck with a student loan this time. So, I don't know. Like today I'm supposed to go to school and do cooking and register for a student loan for real estate school. But in all honesty, what if I don't want to do that? But anyways, um, I think I'm going to end this vlog here. Uh, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Thanks for coming along with my store opening, even though it wasn't too eventful. But I will leave my store link down below. Go check it out. Uh, if you have any suggestions of what you want me to carry in my store or what you want to see, uh, leave them down in the comments and don't forget to like and subscribe that will help me a lot and help my business a lot and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye!